Hello, my name is Leopold Armesto, and in this video I'm about to explain how to install Robotics Toolbox from Peter Cork. It's a well-known uh, toolbox for robotics uh, that has been used during the last uh, 10 years. And um, the idea is to use this toolbox as a client in MATLAB to control simulations using the Copelisim uh, software, the robotics simulator software. So uh, first thing you have to do is to install uh, the toolbox and you can install it if you access to this URL here. And then if you go to the installing uh, section, then you will find a file to download, which is a MATLAB toolbox file. And you just simply can download this file. It's that one here. And then you can simply double click on it to install it. Okay, so let me just simply show you how to do it. I'm using a 2019B version of MATLAB, but probably any of the latest versions of MATLAB also are uh, valid for in order to, to execute this demo. So uh, you will see now that it's installing uh, the toolbox. Indeed, you will see that I already have also uh, the robotic system toolbox from MathWorks. This toolbox here is not the same that the one we are installing because the one we are installing is actually the robotics toolbox for MATLAB version. Okay. And this is the one from Peter Cork. Okay. So the other one, that one is the, the one that MathWorks has developed, but I'm about to explain how to use that one in particular. Okay. So let's close this thing here and then uh, let's close MATLAB. Uh, well, uh, we don't actually need to close MATLAB because I already have uh, the environment variable. So if you go for um, uh, environment variables here, I already have defined a VREP environment uh, variable that it's pointing to uh, the Coppelia SIM software folder. OK, so you have to set this variable here. So Obviously, first time you don't have it, and then in order to succeed, you need to close uh, MATLAB to create a variable and then open MATLAB again so my MATLAB can recognize this uh, environment variable here. Okay, so I have already uh, created, so I don't need to close MATLAB. Okay, so next thing I'm about to explain is uh, then I, I need you to go to uh, this folder here. You can actually go to this folder if you go here. And you just simply click on open folder. Okay, and then you got inside this robotics toolbox, it's the same folder. And we need to modify a few, a couple of uh, files in order to succeed, in order to run uh, the simulation from MATLAB to control a simulation that is being executed in, in VREP. And then what you have to do is to go to interfaces folder here and then VREP folder. And then inside this folder, there's a file which is called vrep.m. We need to edit this file. The reason is that this file here is ready to be used with the previous installations of vrep. And these two lines here, they don't work anymore. Okay, so we have to comment them. So comment them, comment them out. And I'm going to add this other option here, this code here that let me smart indent yeah here it is okay this code here basically it's using uh, some functions uh, that are provided by matlab like spc is mac or is unix and depending on, on this uh, the, the result of these functions the arc variable will uh, have one of these three values and then this uh, thing here will work, okay? And um, this is because I'm using Copelisim uh, 4.0 and the previous code here, it was valid for the version 3.5 something, okay? But not anymore for the four point version, okay? Also, uh, let me just uh, run Copelisim here. And you will see that uh, here, Whenever, whenever you start the Copelisim, that in here you see that there's a plugin re called Remote API, and this plugin uh, usually by default opens a port in 19,997 19, uh, 
and this has to be exactly the same number as we have here, which is in this case, okay, by default. But just make sure you have the, the same the same port open, okay, the same port number, okay. So um, and also you can see here that we are actually getting uh, the environment variable uh, vrep that we have created before. So that's why I need uh, to create this variable here to return a proper path where the software is installed. Okay. Okay. So this is one of the files that I have to fix, but also there's a file here in vrep camera that needs some bug fixing because. Uh, it's in here, yeah, because this function here is part of the uh, toolbox, but it's not available anymore, of the robotics toolbox, I mean. So we actually don't need that part, so we just simply can command it out to run the demo that I'm about to show you, okay? Okay, so once you have done these two modifications, make sure you save the files, and then you have uh, vrep demo, vrep demo that one and make sure just simply here to see exactly what it's doing i'm just simply showing the vrep here on one side and you need just simply in order to run the demo you just simply need a new scene open whatever scene it is a blank scene obviously the better and uh, just click on the demo and let's wait until it works okay so here it is it's that's um, in this case is a build character uh, just being moved by the script in MATLAB, okay? And uh, you will see that there that this demo it's actually running several several uh, demos like that one like to simulate a camera or that one to, in order to move a robot as you can see the joints of a robot. Okay, it's a very short demo, but at least with that demo you can uh, start working with. Uh, using the robotics toolbox uh, from Peter Cork in MATLAB to control simulations uh, that are actually run in Copilessim. So thank you very much.